Hi everyone, this is Trish Kendall. I'm at DFW on my way back to Boston. I've been gone for a couple of days, DC and Dallas for client meetings, workshops, uh, which I will record reflections for each of those, DC and Dallas. But right now, uh, this one is about my Uber driver and the idea of Porter versus Guide, which a lot of you know what I mean there. My Uber driver takes me from my meeting to DFW and I'm trying to book to get to an earlier flight and uh, she shares with me that she takes me to Terminal C and she's like, you know, if your gate changes to a different terminal, you want to make sure that you get on Skylink because Skylink actually takes you to the next terminal. You really can't walk there. And as she's telling me this, I'm not really listening. My brain is thinking about this amazing meeting I had with this group of phenomenal women this morning. And my brain was thinking about my flight and all of those things. So I was like, okay, okay, okay. You're kind, you're nice, thank you for doing that. But I wasn't really thinking about it. Didn't get on the earlier flight. I hunker down at my gate, uh, see whatever. Get into work, I'm just doing all my work. And all of a sudden I look, cause I need to go to my gate and my gate had changed to D. And I was like, oh, hold on. So I get up to walk around, I'm like, where's D? I'm like, holy crap, I gotta go. I gotta get on this flight. I start walking, I was like, stop look around where is skylink my uber driver she told me to find skylink i look up i see the arrow i get on it and it it took me like six or seven minutes on skylink to get to my gate but i run i get to my gate i'm here i'm getting on my flight thank you um she i tr i viewed her more as a porter uh, get me from point A to point B. But because she took a little bit of extra time, she knew from her experience some blind spots that I as the traveler might have. She knew uh, potential roadblocks that I might experience. She chose to give me a little bit more information that could help me in my journey home. And for that, I view her as a guide. Thank you all. Uh, think about your interactions with your client, your customers, your colleagues, and the times that you can uh, create an experience that guides them.